Let me show you guys something. I also upgraded and got this thing. I feel like if you've seen this anywhere, you like expect this to be more flexible than what it is. It's like super sturdy. So I changed my split recently so I don't have it memorized when usually like since I've been on the same split for such a long time, I can wake up and know what day it is. And I woke up today fully, fully expecting it to be a cardio day and it's not. So then right after I was like, okay, I'm gonna celebrate. I'm planning on eating my favorite foods today and I was like, that's the perfect YouTube video. Because people are always curious about what cheat meals I eat. Today is just a, an exception because I'm planning on eating everything. You just have to enjoy the things that you enjoy. <laughs> and that's what today's about. I also bought a new pre-workout to try today. Everyone knows the pre-workout I'm about to show you because everyone and their mom drinks it. Alani knew and they have like a ton of flavors. So I bought Cosmic Stardust, which is sort of calling my name. Hawaiian Shaved Ice. Breezeberry. So I feel like I'm really gonna like Breezeberry and Cosmic Stardust. So I'm going with Hawaiian Shaved Ice. I wanna like leave those for later. 20 milligrams of caffeine, zero sugar. It has 10 calories per can. Ooh, this smells good. I sort of didn't like it. Why does it taste like I'm drinking alcohol? Am I tripping? Do I just have like PTSD with the wine stream, guys? This is the Alpha Elite OG Revival. And then you guys already know the Gymshark Vital Seamless Long Sleeve. I literally could not do without these crop tops. So I'm gonna get ready to head to the gym. I also have to take some of the packages that I packed for the booty bands that you guys purchased and drop them off at the UPS. Um, last night while I was packaging them, I just felt so like stupidly overwhelmed with how grateful I was with the fact that people go out of their way to support me in different ways and last night I, I was just so happy about it like I was because I write notes for each of the booty bands I was like writing the notes and like smiling to myself I feel like I'm gonna get questions about it so this hoodie or sweater is from Joe Brown when I walk down my hallways and like get in this elevator I get PTSD from when I lock myself out and the locksmith had to come but let's talk about that because the other day Long story short, I I feel like this is a safe place and I won't get any judgments for it. I locked myself out again, so I called a different locksmith and he charged me $50. So I just wanted to confirm that I was robbed the first time. Um, another really weird thing, like I hope he doesn't somehow find my social medias, but he the, the first locksmith texted me. First of all, I don't even know how he got my number. <clears throat> but texted me like a week and a half after he unlocked my door and was like, hey, do you want to go on a hike sometime? Like, what? Is the hike gonna cost me I just got done with the workout and I'm heading back to Marcara. Honestly, chest and tricep days are slowly becoming my favorite and I feel like I say that about every muscle group. It just makes you feel so strong. I'm actually gonna head home for a little bit. I'm gonna see my parents eat some of my mama's food because she's literally like a chef in disguise. Hi, say hi. Hi, Sarita! Come here. Okay, so it's the funnel cake, which is basically a funnel cake is like a churro dough. That's literally what it is. Shut up. And then choose cookies and cream ice cream, vanilla ice cream. That's my it's point. Like a, is it warm? It's what you, yes! It's what you want! That's why I'm- uh, 
Hey, come here. <laughs> oh, you're so cute. Are you pissed I'm laying on your bed with these clothes? Why? Because I just came from the gym. No, no, no. Actually, I did literally the Scott wash yesterday. Yeah, so. But are you that bad? Yeah. I, the gym, I just feel like the gym is like a dirty environment. I would not lay I mean, in my you're bed. you're dirty. All the time. Here's the hot chicken place. Look how good that looks. That does look fucking good. Dude, I'm telling you, everyone says it's amazing. It's the Howlin' Race people and then the Funnel Cakes people. Do they tag them? Here, I'm gonna call Diana right now and tell her what we're doing today. Okay. Um, Alright, let me know when. Okay, I'm gonna send you the Funnel Cake place so you can just take a look at what they have. You know what I felt like when I was like, um, going inside your camera? Like those people, um, when they know someone's vlogging and then, or like doing, you know, someone's like on camera somewhere doing something and they're just like consistently walking behind. Yeah. And just, you know. Fuck a red in the pussy. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? That? You don't remember that? No. What? That was like a huge thing. Like he, I was like, what? he, what? he bombed like the news anchor. And said that? Yeah, like the news anchor was talking and he took the mic and like, fuck it right in the pussy. How do you not remember that, dude? It was like a big deal and he kept trying it. to go back. <laughs> like, and they knew who he was. Pull it up on YouTube right no, now. I'm working. No, like, actually I'm, pull it. I'm actually I can't believe working. you don't know fuck. It's like, but it's like a history thing. You actually have to know about this. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. I'm on my way back home. I just texted Lisa. Hopefully uh, she'll be at my place soon. We're gonna go have the best cheat meals. I don't know what my go-to cheat meal is. Like there's a couple things I literally love so much. One of them is hot chicken. If you've never had a hot chicken place, you're missing out. It's like Kane's, it's but better. BJ's Pazuki. Pazuki is like a hot cookie with ice cream on top. I'm not gonna go get that. Instead, I'm gonna get funnel cake, which is like hot cake with also ice cream on top. I can't remember the last time I had funnel cake, but my sister swears it's good and I'm just willing to try it. I think I didn't like it the first time I had it, but like what could go wrong, right? Yeah, let's do the hot. And then I'll also take a side of fries. Fries. That's a lot. What so the hell is cuts? this? Oh, that's cute. These are my nuggies. I guess they're not bad. Hmm? How am I gonna eat? With your hands. I hate that. Mm -hmm. What do you think? I mean, I ate the fry. I don't know. Okay. It's hot. I don't know, it was like a burger. There's a lot of stuff in here that I probably didn't want. Like coleslaw? Yeah. <laughs> I hate col coleslaw. Mm -mm. Was that good? I should just gone tender. So they don't have them. What was that? Mm. Why, you want a toothpick? Oh, okay, you know what this tastes like? I'll tell you right now what this tastes like. Remember when we made hot chicken in our house? Mm -hmm. It tastes exactly like it. They just Googled the recipe like we did. Mine is too spicy. Mine is too powdery. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like I can taste the mm -hmm. spicy. <laughs> I, I wouldn't come here again. Mm -mm. Does it like look juicy? It looks really good, but it doesn't taste that good. <laughs> look at how power... Look at the detail on this bitch. <laughs> look, at the, look how powdery look at that it is. Camera. They need less pepper, more like lard. Walk to fire for you. Okay, you know who I'm mad at? All these customers. They're lying, right? If this would howl and raise his like. <laughs> but now we're gonna go order funnel cakes. If it's even half as bad as this place, I'm never gonna talk to my sister again. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Man, we can't catch a break. Listen, these toppings and everything taste good. It's the fun of that I'm not a fan of. It's it's good. It tastes like a churro, like a light churro. I would prefer the churro to be like heavier. 